say in my head that yes my i am mentally fit i am physically fit i am feeling very healthy uh, i am going to study very properly today today is going to be a good day hey guys welcome or welcome back to my channel very light like mbbs today i am with a very special guest gauri soni also known as uh, kutlo uh, he also has a youtube channel uh, he is currently a first year mbbs student at bj medical college pune So today I'm with him to discuss his journey uh, from a neat aspirant to an MBBS student. So before uh, going in deep with this conversation, I would like to welcome Gorish and would uh, would thank him for giving his time and also would like him to introduce uh, himself to my audience. Yes, uh, thank you so much, ma'am. Uh, first of all, it is an absolute pleasure. Medilight MBBS is something which I saw during my neat preparation journey, and uh, it is really a dream come true to be sitting and chatting with ma'am. Uh, hello, everyone. Again, as ma'am said, I'm a first year MBBS student at BJMC Pune, and uh, I uh, thankfully was able to get six forty five marks uh, in my very first attempt in neat UG examination. And uh, yes, I am uh, now uh, finally I can say that I'm an MBBS student now. and i'm very excited to be here thank you for having me parish my very first question is what was your reaction when you realized that you are no more a neat aspirant and finally going to be a medical student or an mbbs student uh well yeah that was definitely a surreal experience even uh, me and my friends uh, in one of the day in our canteen used to discuss that oh my god i was still i was sitting in this mbbs college like this is uh, definitely something which we have dreamt of kyunki neat itne bar postpone ho gayi thi we were like kab hoga kab jayenge hum college mein and uh, definitely after neat also there was a long vacation uh, because the counseling pura uh, process delay ho gaya tha Uh, so definitely it was a very good feeling uh, at one point of time i lost interest in mbbs i was like chodo abhi kuch dusra karte ho hi nahi raha hai aage matlab counseling hi nahi shuru ho rahi hai and because pora pe we used to constantly check out about and used to do a college review and discuss among our friends so yeah that was the feeling and finally i am feeling uh, a lot of responsibility suddenly on my shoulders that oh my god now i am an mbbs because the society see you in a completely different way for you you are just one year older and have transferred from neat to mbbs but uh, according to your parents and especially when you are from non medical background then definitely your parents and your society and even if you are living in, a, in any private accommodation or your society kind of uh, uh, sees you in a very different light and that is very special feeling for me yes now let's talk about your neat journey i think this is one of the most important questions according to me See, journey as a neat aspirant is a very difficult as you are in your teens high levels of hormones yeah. distractions and uh, you were also from the covid batch there were yeah. so many postponements how did you handle everything yeah it was a uh, little bit tough definitely uh, for me personally i am kind of an introvert kind of person and i always enjoyed uh, the thing that we are getting online classes for me i was really happy uh, honestly if i uh, tell you then covid has played a very important role in my life very positively it was a blessing in disguise and i was able to prepare really well because i got a lot of vacation during covid time uh so for me uh, honestly it was uh, it had had a positive impact obviously touch wood i was lucky enough to get a comfortable place at my home and there was nothing too much to worry for uh, definitely people have uh, gone through very tough time during this covid period uh, mentally and physically and emotionally but uh, uh, for me i was kind of coming from privileged background where i do not have to think a lot about this stuff and i properly prepared uh, for my uh, need only during this covid period definitely speaking about different distraction they were definitely there one tip that i would like to give all of them that mai pehle se hi pre plan kar leta tha ki meko itna itna break lena hai so i was uh, already decided ki 3 to 3:30 break lenge fir 6 to 6:30 break lenge so between those time uh, it was completely focus study and uh, during break i used to do whatever i feel like doing so i think pre plan we pre plan the studies but i believe that if we also pre plan our breaks it will be really useful because otherwise to fir hum matlab kabhi bhi break le lete kitna bhi break le lete so uh, that become really difficult so uh, pre plan your enjoyment period also and your hustle period also so to say
So these are the stuffs are uh, not only going to help you during your only beauty yeah. preparation, but also going to help you in your PG preparation yeah. also and during your university yeah. exam yeah. also. So great, uh, it happens with everyone. Uh, it also happens with me sometimes. So when you are but you have to study at uh, that time. What was your favorite subject and why? Uh, well, definitely it is very common to not feel interested in studies from time to time, uh, especially when there is such vast syllabus. Uh, again, as I said, I used to, uh, you know, focus on my hobbies and do, uh, like, if time pass, then you can take a little time to take a little time to take a little time to take a little time because otherwise it will be in your mind. And my favorite subject, so to say, was chemistry, definitely. Uh, I think, my uh, friend said, you are an exception who likes chemistry. But uh, I used to always enjoy chemistry chemistry nothing uh, i really didn't feel uh, uh, fearful of organic or inorganic or physical like that and uh, physics was kind of my least favorite subject i think yeah so uh, uh, one thing i also uh, one, uh, uh, want to add like i also loved chemistry it was my favorite yeah. more than biology yeah. used to love that stuff very good because it was a combination of everything, everything. because you just not only going to rectify, you have to understand so many things. Yes. So uh, now coming to the next question, if not MBBS, then what course occupation would you like to choose? Uh, well, uh, that is a really uh, very interesting question. Uh, I believe that, as I said, my favorite subject was chemistry and uh, the CET exam bhi hoti hai, and uh, I got really good score in that. Uh, I was getting... Uh, Maharashtra's number one and probably India's number one uh, B Pharma College, which is ICT, Matunga, Mumbai. And uh, uh, fun fact, Mukesh Ambani also uh, did his chemical engineering from that college. Uh, I uh, would love, I, I would have gone there probably for doing my B Pharma uh, if it was not uh, MBBS. And uh, yeah, even to even like right now, as I mean, I completely am against like how uh, 17, 18 years old uh, kid have to decide what they want to do for their entire life. I think the whole educational system is kind of fault in faulty in that way. And uh, even though I have taken MBBS, it is not like very rigid. Like for some people, it is like like really a basic dream and stuff like that. For me, it was not uh, like that. I would have happily chosen something else if uh, not MBBS. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, my next question is, uh, three mantra to, to stand to your knee journey. Anything uh, as uh, specific or... I think definitely consistency. It is something which uh, even uh, we were discussing before uh, shooting this video that consi how consistency is extremely important in MBBS and NEET PG and in any competitive exam. So consistency is extremely important. Uh, second thing is hard work. Again, you can get nothing. Uh, those are the those are the cliche thing, you know, consistency, hard work, and never give up attitude and. Uh, those are the things which people kind of say and we neglect it. But it is kind of true. Those are the three things which if you uh, stand by and if you are resilient, then you can definitely make it and you can get whatever you think. One of my favorite uh, thing which uh, keep me going uh, was uh, that every single day of mine looked kind of same. Whether it was Sunday or Monday or any other day, I used to wake up and say, okay, this is the routine, whatever you need, whatever you must do, do it. But you cannot uh, feel like, you know, doing things. And I used to always uh, uh, say in my head that, yes, my, I am mentally fit, I am physically fit, I am feeling very healthy, uh, I am going to study very properly today, today is going to be a good day. Even uh, as soon as I wake up and as soon as I used to sleep and it it worked like miracle and uh, if i have to say like i don't know how many people will believe it but not a single day in last six uh, like before my neat examination in last six months or eight months not a single day i felt ill like uh, there was no cold no cough no seasonal uh, disease but so to say uh, thankfully no covid de definitely but 
लाइक लिटरली देर वॉज नॉट अ सिंगल डे वेर आई फील लाइक चलो आज तो मेरे को फीवर आ रहा है और मैं आज सोने वाला हूँ इवन द डे आई टूक वैक्सीनेशन आई वॉज कम्प्लीटली ओके माई फर्स्ट डोज ऑफ कोविड सो आई थिंक गिविंग पॉजिटिव एफर्मेशन टू योर सेल्फ रियली हेल्प यू एंड आई नो मैम ऑल्सो इज काइंड ऑफ इन टू इट एज वी हैव ऑल सीन हर रूम टू अर वीडियो एंड सी हैव kept a lot of like positive notes uh, which she write to herself and i think those are the things which uh, also resonate with me because mai bhi aisa karta tha aur mai man ke man mein wo bolta tha and really it really works it really works so uh, all these positive stuff see uh, like my uh, teacher used to say me if uh, tumne dimag mein aisa soch liya hai ki ye mujhse nahi hoga that stuff is going bounce in your mind 100 times and at the end of the day you are going to do nothing mm-hmm. instead keep one thing ki yaar tera nahi hoga to kiska hoga right. so right. coming to the next question uh, favorite time pass during your need preparation i think uh, giving time to your hobbies and time pass is extremely important uh, it is as important as doing studies honestly uh, according to me i was really interested in yoga and not like uh, just to uh, like lose weight or something like that it u- usually calm you used to calm me uh, my uh, body and my mentally everything physically and mentally uh, so yoga was definitely one of the thing i like to dance so dance was also one of the uh, time pass that i used to do again uh, common things i used to love watching youtube videos i watched so many youtube videos probably that is the thing where kind of manifested in becoming a youtuber uh, mams videos and many other uh, people related to medicine or not and uh, listening to music all those uh, common random stuff yeah okay so uh, what are few lines which kept you motivated throughout your need journey right uh, so uh, i think uh, one of the thing which many people write to me in the comment section ki bhaiya ab to 2 mahine baki hai hamara 11th waste ho gaya abhi humko hoga ke nahi one thing that i always tell everybody that and uh, we actually kind of said it before also that whatever you think you can and whatever you think you can't both are always equally right Uh, so I think those are the things. सब दिमाग में है अगर आप सोचते हो दैट आपका होगा देन इट विल हैपन एंड अगर आप में वो कन्विक्शन ही नहीं है पहले से इफ यू आर डाउटिंग यूर सेल्फ इवन बिफोर यू हैव स्टार्टेड देन देन यू आर ऑलरेडी हाफ डिफिटेड सो दैट इज द थिंग दैट ऑलवेज वन शुड बी ऑप्टेमिस्टिक एंड आई थिंक दोज आर द लाइन्स विच एक्चुअली केप मी गोइंग की एवरीथिंग इज इन द हेड एंड इफ यू पुट यूर सेल्फ थ्रू इट एंड इफ यू आर यू नो वेरी डिटर्माइंड इनफ कि ये करना ही है तो फिर हो जाएगा बिकॉज आई रिमेम्बर आई हैव रिटर्न समवेयर दैट आई आई मस्ट गेट सिक्स एटी प्लस मार्क्स नाउ आई डि नॉट गो गॉट सो मच मार्क्स बट आई गॉट रीजनेबली गुड स्कोर विच इज विच वॉज इनफ टू गेट मी इन टू गुड कॉलेज सो दैट इज इट यू नो यू शुड ऑलवेज कीप योर एक्सपेक्टेशन अ लिटिल हायर बट ऑल्सो अंडरस्टैंड दैट यू नो दैट ऑल्सो टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट मार्क्स आर नॉट द एंड ऑफ थिंग्स एंड देर इज मच मोर बियॉन्ड एवरीथिंग Uh, and your life is the most important thing like uh, your health and your uh, these things are the most important thing but yeah those those are the things which keep me going that if you put yourself uh, to through it then you will definitely get through be determined and try to keep slightly high expectation mm-hmm. because that will at least come to uh, the edge mm-hmm. of that yeah. So yeah, yeah. you are definitely going to achieve something big in your life. Yeah. So my last question to you uh, for today's session or today's interview is that any message for the need aspirant who are watching this video. Uh, yes, uh, definitely. Uh, I would like to uh, give all of them uh, one of the things which I felt uh, that I did kind of um, wrong because as much as we want to say that meko to doctor hi banna hai and these are the things. but you are going to change after a period of time and your ideologies are going to change probably you will still love keep living the uh, love loving the profession or uh, not liking it as much uh, so uh, one of the thing which i felt that i should have done is ki 11 12 the math thoda rakho <laughs> that is the one thing which i would like to it is a very practical like i feel that it is important unless you are very sure that you want to do medicine but uh, my father used to tell me that gaurish please take to, uh, math in 12th and i was like no i want to do neat and i will focus completely on it even though don't focus that much on uh, matlab math so to say or otherwise if anyone from mathematics is watching then biology so to say but keep your options a little open like i remember many of my friend did not even uh, gave a cet examination which get you into different colleges other than uh, of medicine 
uh, and uh, they kind of felt bad and now they have kind of wasted their one year and now are again going to give the examination so keep your option a little open also understand that uh, do not uh, From starting only ऐसा मत रखो कि रिपीट ही करेंगे एंड स्टफ लाइक दैट आई थिंक इट इज अ वेरी नाउ अभी बहुत ट्रेंड में चल गया है ये रिपीट होना कि एक बार दो बार तीन बार कितने भी बार कर ले आई नथिंग रॉन्ग विद दैट बट ऑल्सो काइंड ऑफ अंडरस्टैंड दैट यू नो टाइम इज अ लिमिटेड एसेट एंड यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू गेट दिस यूथ अगेन सो काइंड ऑफ प्रिपेयर वेल इन योर फर्स्ट अटेम्प्ट ओनली एंड ट्राई टू कीप द मेंटेलिटी कि मेरे को मतलब करना ही है जो इसी बार में करना है एंड ऑल्सो Uh, stay consistent uh, keep working hard and i am sure you will get through it yeah so one thing i also want to add in this uh, ki he said ki uh, first attempt uh, is going to be your best attempt because yeah. you are uh, not like uh, thinking ki bhai nahi hoga to kya hoga mm-hmm. because uh, the anxiety level कितना भी कर लो एक बार दिमाग में चीजें बैठ जाती है कि यार नहीं होगा मतलब मेरा सेकंड अटेम्प्ट है तो क्या होगा वगैरह दीज आर गोइंग टू यू हेल्प यू साइकोलॉजिकली इवन इवन इफ यू आर नॉट नोइंग कि इट इज गोइंग टू अफेक्ट यू सो व्हाट एवर यू वांट टू डू डोंट थिंक अबाउट योर सेकंड ऑप्शन की सेकंड ऑप्शन आई एम नॉट बट ट्राई टू फोकस ऑन थिंग एंड ट्राई टू अचीव इन अ वन गो बिकॉज यू आर गोइंग टू गेट Hundred and ten percent to that. Yeah, so, you are going to be at your optimum performance. Same, I think. Um, I am put it in a more pr- proper and structured way. Again, I would like to clarify. I am not against like this attempt and stuff thing. Like uh, whatever suits you, I think it is uh, each to its own. But try to get it into that because uh, you know if you if you worked a little harder now in your first attempt, you can you know save a, a complete year. So that would really work for you. So yeah. so that's what that was the end of this uh, session i really loved talking to goresh and uh, guys he also has a youtube channel which i already told you i'll put a link in the description box below do check and all the need aspirant who are uh, watching this video kindly go and check because he put all the stuff related to the preparation how to uh, handle biology chemistry and uh, physics everything related to that as well as he is going uh, i think he will also put his journey uh, as a mbbs student so uh, that will give you a, give you a great motivation to study well and crack neat and i hope to see all you guys uh, next year in medical college yeah. as my junior as his juniors so that's all for today's uh, video thank you goresh for giving your time and thank you guys for watching no it's a absolute pleasure uh, i think if there are any more question that you would like to uh, ask me then you can put in the description uh, you can put in the comment section below i will uh, be very sure to check it out or we can uh, do any part two of this video if there are more question and uh, please subscribe to ma'am's channel as well i think she makes amazing content and even i am a subscriber and i am a great uh, watcher uh, so uh, thank you so much for having me ma'am